Is it possible to clean the world's most disgusting vehicle? Today I'm going to be using these items to make sure this 20 year old vehicle looks brand new again. I'm probably going to find a new virus in there, I'm not even lying. There's gone off milk, meatballs, that's been in there for how long? Why does it still look brand new? Yo, McDonald's out here, you know. <laughs> the state of the car was so bad, I actually didn't think it was possible to get it looking at least usable again. But, like everything, you've got to start with the first step. First step, I need to clear the inside of the car. There's a lot of stuff in there that can go and bin bag. So, first step, we're clearing it out. Oh my god! I'll try not to breathe any of that in, yeah, I beg you. <laughs> I can do three, four, five seconds in there, Max. Let's do this for the people, yeah. Ah! I'm scared there's not stuff in my mouth, even though there's not anything in my mouth. Ah! Bro, is that gone off milk? Gone off milk, bro. It's got lumps on it. A bit of Parmesan, bro. If any of your like, cars look like this, yeah, and you drive it, yeah, have a word with yourself, you know what I'm saying? Bro, my childish one is done, you know. Bro, it looks peng, you know, bro. It's back to you, Taylor. We didn't even plan that either, you know what I'm saying? Luke didn't even want to try and plug it, but he just thought it was nice, you get me? Yeah. 29th of May, you get me? The last Sunday of the month, hey, then comes, yeah, you can cop the hoodie piece, you get me? I'm gonna have to just get in here. Oh, you brave man. The meatballs! The meatballs, bro! Mentally, I've left, bro. You're not even present. I'm just my body's in here. Bro, I'm in my office playing cards. Hold on, does that mean you're a poltergeist right now? <laughs> <laughs> bro, what are these dusty cars, man? Who the fuck, yeah? Thinks these are a good idea, bro. <laughs> Gone off meatballs, smudged into the carpet, man. Why is it green? <laughs> my childish shirt is covered in smeared meatballs, you know? Dinner trays in the back seat. Even my rolls don't have that. What's going on? Is that semen? Bro, that's a hell of a shot, bro. Bro, that's semen, you know, bro. No, David. Someone had fun in here, you know. You're sitting in it, bro. How do you feel? Fuck it, bro. I'm starting worse. Like what? On you, remember? <laughs> <Not me. laughs> bro, someone had a newbie. What's that mean? Who said that, bro? Oh, my God. That's <gasps> No! Do you need some air, bro? I feel like you should get it for a sec. I'm not quitting, you know. Yeah, nah, for a sec, bro. Just breathe, like, for your health and stuff. My mom didn't raise no punk ass. You see that? That's an example of what we want the car to look like afterwards. That clean all over. Even the windows and that, you get me? You want them to look like carpet. I need to fully scrape that out the carpet, bro. This is going to take me ages. I'm done with the back seats. I'm going to do the boot and I'm going to do the front footwells and the seats because it looks like a Trojan horse took control of it. You know what I'm saying? I know that front passenger seat, yeah, double click to zip far from mega upload. Get me. Well, he's kind of nice right now, you know. <laughs> yeah. Yo, what are you doing, bro? YouTubers, box, bro. I'll swing bags of meatballs, you know what you're saying, yeah, my yeah, yeah, good hey, yeah. <laughs> You know when like the tissue rips when you're wiping your ass and your finger goes up, your bum comes out your mouth. Oh, a little it bit. slips a bit. Yeah. yeah. Stay of that, bro. Bro, he's clicked on a dodgy link there. You know, I'm telling you, bro, contracted a virus. Don't know if that really had an effect, you know. There's bugs in here. This place is rotten, you know. I'm literally looking at an earwig crawling across the floor right now. It's disgusting. Hopefully this is a good hoover. I don't have a clue what it is. It's literally an Amazon piece. It works! I've got a little trick for you all here. They say you make um, hoovers more powerful. So you take this part here and you pull it like that. Let's liberate. How, how does that make it more powerful? Yo, bro. Get yourself a Dyson. Dyson never misses, you know. Ask anybody on the streets. Oh, God, there's cheeseburgers on the floor, man. Mackey's fries, barbecue sauce, a candle. As you can see down the sides of the seats, were filled with fries, McDonald's chicken nuggets, barbecue sauce. The stench was horrific. Monster can, another monster can. Gone off fries, gone off Subway. Barbecue sauce, cheeseburgers, Ikea receipts. Look at the dashboard of this car. <laughs> The state of that. McDonald's fries and burgers wedged all into the air conditioning. Bro, I need something thin and long, you know. Unzip your trousers. I've never pulled fries out of an air conditioner when I've cleaned the car. Bro, there's music tapes just in the glove box, man. These are getting launched. Bro, why is there Cliff Richard in here, dude? How in the sweet sausage roll did somebody get fries in the windshield of this car? Who the hell owned this car? I think I'm done cleaning all the excess food and shit in here, basically. So now we're going to move on to the outside of the car and getting rid of all the mud. This is the most satisfying part of the job, I'm not going to lie. This is demon foam. You spray it on the car, it lets it and lifts all of the mud. You let it set for about five minutes and then all the mud just comes flying off much easier. Oh, oh, get the tires, we get the lights. 
The windscreen. It's like dessert, bro. You got demon foam all on the lens. So as you can see, I'm politely demon foaming the fuck out of the exterior of this car. This should help lift the dirt. All you detailing nerds out there, right? If you're watching this video because you've seen other people do it, I'm not a professional, right? I understand I've probably fucked this job up already. Oh, bro, look at the mud dripping off. Look at the mud dripping off. Bro, it's starting to lift all the mud already. There's a pool of mud forming on the floor, you know. I'm really satisfied. I wouldn't be surprised if this video gets uploaded to Pornhub, you know. First person to upload this video to Pornhub. That's if you've got an account, you have to have an account to upload to Pornhub, don't you? It's like Oreo milkshake has just been thrown at the window. Look at it leaking down, bro. That's art right there. <laughs> Is that you? Bro, you meant to like cover the car, yeah? Not use it <laughs> to clean the petrol can? <laughs> I ain't got nothing to do with the way he's doing that. That's him. If you're hating on this video, it's him, not me. Wait, see that little bit there? Yeah, watch this. Bro, you're ruining my video. Bro, you look like, what's this here, bro? Look, I can see paint. You can't just come in, yeah, and saying I did a bad job, yeah, when you're spraying petrol caps. Yo, guys, what sort of shaving with your fish and chips? I don't want to see any comments saying mushy peas, you know. <laughs> if you have mushy peas, like, Ted. you're weird. That's some Ted Bundy type beat, yes. <laughs> That, yo, run out of foam, you know. You actually use it all on a petrol cap, bro. You need it cleaning, bro. Can you get any more satisfying than demon foaming a car? Literally spray your car, coat it with a white foam, leave it set for 10 minutes, and it's going to pull every bit of dirt out of the exterior for you. The foam is set in for a good 15 minutes now, and now it's time for us to power wash it all off. Hopefully get every bit of dirt off there, and then we go on to the inside of the car and start cleaning all the inside with the spot vacuum. That is going to be very satisfying because it's going to pull all the mud out of the seat. <laughs> Check the dirt right there, bro. How easy it comes off. It's like magic. I need to have my own jet wash brand deal, bro. But if you know any good jet wash companies, yeah. Get your boy up at by J Swingler on Instagram. Just DM me pictures on Instagram, yeah, of, of jet washers. Okay, I got a fetish. I don't think I was actually joking there. I think I can safely say that I have an addiction to jet washing dirt off a car. What the fuck is that, bro? What's that? Whoa! I've been handed a faulty vehicle. You know, we're whipping this to Scunny later tonight. Get right in that crack, Sunny Jim. Woo! Get right in those seals, my guy. Look at all this grime here. Yeah, watch this, bro. That is beautiful, isn't it? My arsehole's twitching. How many people do you reckon I just triggered? So many, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try and start the engine now and see what happens to the exhaust. I mean, if you want to sit in there, yeah, go for it. I'm even going to step back though, just in case. <laughs> Yo, that sucks. <laughs> oh my God. You get a Bugatti when you're a bit older, yeah? First thing you do, yeah, trust me, stick a hose in the exhaust and leave it running overnight, man. My uncle taught me that. Bro, what happens when you do that? Helps the speed. Because it doesn't have, you can't activate the horsepower when you first buy it. <laughs> Look at my garage windows. No. Nah. No. <laughs> oh my god. Look at the state of this car. Guys, wait till you see how clean we get this car to look at the end of this video. It's actually mad. Why is there a house freaking the windscreen wipers? Pure sludge, man. So inside there is all like green moss. You ready? Watch this. Oh. Check that out now. Look at that. Next step, yeah, I'm just going to get off all the excess dirt and food basically with this hoover. So next up, we're just going to clean the car. We're going to hoover up all the little bits before we go in there with a deep spot clean. The spot clean next is going to be another satisfying process of the job. So satisfying. This little tool here is going to suck all of the dirt out of these chairs. Okay, you cannot tell me this isn't the most satisfying thing ever. Sucking the bum dust out of the seats. That is actually disgusting. I'm not going to lie. There's probably diabetes embedded in the cotton. I'm blown away. Hey boy, that is a bit damp, but I'll dry out, you know what I mean? Look at that ass dust, bro! How much to drink that? No chance. I've just cleaned a smeg-filled car. Oh! It looks like ass juice, bro. How many asses have farted into these seats, nah. bro? Look, bro, look at that brown and stuff, bro. Come on, look. Look at this one. What am I doing with that? So satisfying.
So this is a steamer. With this, I'm gonna be able to clean all of the plastics and all of the fabrics inside the car, which has like excess amounts of this shit on. Um, I'm not gonna lie, this tool, piece of wank, never use one, don't waste your money. It's like the car's in the showroom. All right, don't push it. <laughs> It's important that you do this because you want to lift all of the mud at the end. It's the most vital part, so you make sure you lift all the mud at the end. This is my favourite part, man. It's so satisfying. You know, when you're doing that, what are you trying to achieve? The engine coolant ran out. If your engine coolant runs out, it's a good way to kind of lubricate the whole engine again. I don't think this is going to start. But yeah, 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 go on. Yeah, go for it, bro. I am so shocked. What the hell? Yeah. I, th I, think you, I think you've revved it enough. I need to jet wash the inside to clean all the foam off. It is finally time to reveal what this car now looks like compared to what it looked like two, two days prior. It took two days to do this. Ladies and gentlemen, take a look at this brand new German. Don't even think it's German. I think it's Polish or some shit. <laughs> 